Imagine a world where the laws of nature are rewritten, where the boundaries of possibility stretch beyond imagination. In this realm of wonders, picture a planet unlike any other world, a world where it rains lava all day long, where the very essence of life dances in a mesmerizing symphony of fire and heat. In the annals of space exploration, we discover a multitude of awe-inspiring worlds that defy every notion of safety and familiarity. Among them lies a celestial inferno known as 55 Cancri E, a desolate planet locked in an eternal embrace with its blistering star. Its surface, a tortured landscape of molten rock and unimaginable temperatures, dares any traveler to venture near its scorching embrace. But fear not, for our expedition into the realm of danger and wonder has only just begun. Prepare yourself for a voyage to Kepler 10b, a realm cloaked in mystery, where searing lava oceans boil beneath an ashen sky. Here, the very air you breathe would ignite with a single spark, and the ground beneath your feet would sear through the toughest of boots. And yet, in the boundless expanse of the universe, there are more worlds that command our attention and fuel our insatiable curiosity. We invite you to witness the majesty of Hat P7b, a place where raging storms of a liquid metal tear through the atmosphere with ferocious might. On this celestial stage, winds scream at supersonic speeds, and clouds are composed not of water vapor but of vaporized minerals. Behold the extraordinary theater of nature's fury. But that's not all. From planets that are shaped like an egg to planets that rain real diamonds, our voyage through the cosmos is an endless procession of marvels and surprises, Meet Gliese 436b, a sized planet that defies the laws of physics by maintaining seething hotness despite its icy composition. It's one of the closest exoplanets to us, about 33 light years from us. This exoplanet is about the size of Neptune and is a mere 2.5 million miles away from its respective star, Gliese 436. For reference, Mercury is a staggering 35 million miles from the Sun. The surface is a scorching 822 degrees Fahrenheit. Without even thinking, you'll expect to find volcanoes and magma all over its surface, but no. Instead, the planet's unique composition and intense gravity create a fascinating phenomenon of burning ice. Its atmosphere transforms into a spectacle of burning gases propelled into space by the star's heat, leaving behind a mesmerizing comet-like tail that stretches for 9 million miles. To an observer standing on Gliese 436b, the experience would be truly otherworldly. The heat would be unbearable, yet the ground beneath your feet would be cold and solid, a sensation that defies all logic. The skies would be filled with swirling storms of steam and vapor, driven by the extreme temperature gradients between the surface and the upper atmosphere. Imagine a world where darkness reigns supreme, where light goes to die, and the very concept of reflection fades away. Welcome to the eerie realm of Tress 2b, a place that defies our understanding of planetary existence and plunges us into a realm of perpetual night. In this mysterious exoplanet, darkness is not merely an absence of light, but an entity in itself. Tress 2b is a place of shadows, a planet so black that it challenges the boundaries of what we thought possible. As you step foot on this enigmatic world, the first thing that strikes you is the absence of any discernible features, as if the universe itself has veiled this planet in an impenetrable cloak. The inky blackness of Treus 2b arises from its unique composition and atmospheric conditions. As you look up to the sky, you see no stars, no distant galaxies. It's as if the very fabric of the cosmos has conspired to hide its celestial wonders from your gaze. The planet's surface, shrouded in perpetual darkness, absorbs an astonishing 99% of the light that falls upon it. The world devours light, leaving nothing to escape its clutches. But how does Tress 2b achieve this seemingly impossible feat? Scientists believe that the planet's atmosphere is to blame. It is composed of exotic chemicals and compounds that trap and absorb light, rendering the planet virtually invisible. Its dense, light-absorbing molecules act as a cosmic sponge, swallowing any glimmer of illumination that dares to approach. 
The darkness that envelops Tress 2B is all-consuming, creating an atmosphere of perpetual nightmarish twilight. No sunrises, no sunsets grace the horizon. Instead, a dim, unearthly glow suffuses the landscape, casting long, foreboding shadows that seem to stretch into infinity. The very concept of light and darkness becomes blurred, merging into an indistinguishable haze that wraps around you. Okay, let's take a break from all that terror. I need you to picture a sky filled, not with a single ring, like our Saturn, but with an intricate tapestry of countless rings, each more magnificent than the last. J1407B is a world of rings, but not just any rings. These majestic rings are on a scale far surpassing our wildest dreams. As you gaze upward, the rings stretch across the heavens, casting an ethereal glow upon the landscape below. Their sheer size and complexity defy our understanding of planetary systems, hinting at a cosmic dance that unfolds on a grand stage. The rings of J1407b are so vast that they would dwarf Saturn's rings into insignificance. Imagine ring systems spanning hundreds of times the size of our Earth, with gaps and divisions that reveal a symphony of celestial motion. These rings are a testament to the intricate interplay between gravity and celestial bodies, a cosmic choreography that has captivated astronomers for ages. The sunlight filters through the gaps, casting a mesmerizing interplay of light and shadow upon the landscape. It is a world where day and night are painted with a celestial brush, where the very fabric of space and time seems to weave an intricate tapestry around you. Yeah, that's it for the quick break. Meet HD 189733b, a gas giant 64 light years away from us. The planet gets its deep, beautiful azure color from the planet's strange atmosphere, which is actually made up mostly of silicate atoms and particles. In this chilling realm, the winds howl with such ferocity that even hurricanes on Earth would cower in fear. Winds on HD 189733b can reach an inconceivable speed of 5,400 miles per hour, a terrifying velocity surpassing 2 kilometers per second. To put it into perspective, this malevolent planet's winds scream past at over seven times the speed of sound, shattering any semblance of tranquility in its wake. As if the horrifying winds weren't enough, the atmosphere holds a dreadfully scorching secret. Temperatures soar to unimaginable heights, blistering well above 1652 degrees Fahrenheit. The unbearable heat would reduce the sturdiest materials on Earth to ashes instantaneously. It's a relentless inferno, where the very air scorches and engulfs everything in its path. As if that was not enough, the planet experiences a haunting rain of glass. Imagine jagged shards hurtling sideways through the air, slicing through anything unfortunate enough to cross their path. The agony of being caught in this macabre storm would be unbearable, as the merciless glass shards tear through flesh and bone, leaving a trail of destruction in their wake. To emphasize the magnitude of horror, envision this catastrophic storm unleashed at the equator of our own Earth. The storm's unrelenting force would traverse the entire circumference of our planet in unfathomable five and a half hours, perpetuating terror and devastation at an unimaginable pace. HD 189733b is a realm of nightmares, where the atmosphere itself conspires to torment any soul that dares to venture near. But that's not all. Remember when I mentioned a planet shaped like an egg? About 870 light-years away, this oddball exoplanet is one of a class of so-called hot Jupiters that orbit very close to their host star and are heated to enormous temperatures. Deep within the core of this nightmarish realm, a potential diamond heart formed by an equal ratio of carbon to oxygen. However, any glimmers of hope are quickly extinguished, for this exoplanet conceals its precious core from the prying eyes of space. Enveloped in a foreboding cloak of dense, dark clouds composed of methane and carbon monoxide, WASP-12b devours light with insatiable hunger, trapping a staggering 94% of it. The result? A blackness that surpasses even the darkest coal, rendering it an abyssal void where light goes to die. But the terrors of WASP-12b do not end with its impenetrable darkness. 
The planet's ghastly proximity to its blazing star subjects it to a cataclysmic fate. The relentless tug of the star's intense gravity contorts WASP-12b into a grotesque, distorted shape, an egg of cosmic horror. Imagine a celestial entity, grotesquely elongated, as if being stretched by invisible, malevolent hands. This diamond space egg, however, bears a haunting death sentence. The star's gravitational grip tightens like a noose around the planet's fragile existence, drawing it closer to a fiery inferno. With each passing moment, WASP-12b hurtles towards its own annihilation, given a mere three million years to live. 630 light years away from us lies one of the hottest known planets, if not the hottest, choked with noxious gases, harbors unimaginable storms of sulfuric acid and ferocious winds that tear through the darkness with otherworldly wrath. The planet's tormented surface bears witness to these tempests, etched with scars of destruction and chaos. Kelt 9b an ultra-hot Jupiter orbits its star, Kelt 9, with an intensity that defies comprehension. Its proximity to its parent star is so close that temperatures on the planet reach unimaginable extremes. Brace yourself for a temperature that soars above a horrifying 7,800 degrees Fahrenheit, a seething inferno that consumes everything in its path. This is a world where the very air is a cauldron of vaporous metal, as elements like iron and titanium are heated to their gaseous states. The atmosphere itself becomes a twisted, roiling sea of molten elements, a toxic brew that defies all notions of habitability. It is a realm where the very breath you take would scorch your lungs and leave you gasping for respite. As you delve deeper into the heart of this oppressive world, you witness a landscape that defies all expectations. The very ground beneath your feet glows with eerie incandescence, as if the planet itself is aflame. The barren wastelands stretch out before you, devoid of life and consumed by a relentless fury. Rogue planets, also known as interstellar or orphan planets, are celestial bodies that roam through space without being gravitationally bound to any star. These wandering entities are untethered from the gravitational influence of a parent star and drift aimlessly through the vast cosmos. Their paths are shaped by chance encounters with other celestial bodies, gravitational interactions, and galactic forces. As these rogue planets traverse the depths of space, their paths are dictated by chance encounters with other celestial bodies and the gravitational pull of neighboring stars. They become cosmic vagabonds, forever in search of a place to call home. Their journeys take them through vast interstellar voids, haunted by the eerie silence and a sense of profound solitude. What makes rogue planets truly terrifying is their inherent enigma. These nomads defy the conventional notions of planetary formation, casting doubt on our understanding of the universe. Their origins remain shrouded in mystery, leaving us to ponder the cataclysmic events that led to their detachment from their parent stars. Were they once part of a planetary system torn asunder by celestial cataclysms? Or did they form independently, born from the chaos of interstellar dust and gas? Examples of these wandering entities abound in the cosmos, and each carries its own chilling tale. Take, for instance, this planet discovered through microlensing, which amplifies the light of a background star as the planet passes in front of it. This desolate world, drifting through the void, evokes a sense of cosmic abandonment, cut adrift from the warm embrace of a nurturing star. Or consider this one, a rogue planet residing in the depths of the Alpha Centauri star system. This lonely wanderer, a mere 20 light years away, is shrouded in perpetual darkness, never to bask in the life-giving glow of a nearby sun. Its existence serves as a chilling reminder of the harsh realities that await those adrift in the cosmic abyss. What sets these rogue planets apart is the absence of light and warmth, plunging them into a perpetual gloom. The eternal night that envelops their surfaces becomes a haunting symbol of desolation and despair. In the absence of a star's radiance, temperatures plummet to bone-chilling lows, rendering these worlds frozen wastelands, where life as we know it would struggle to survive. As these rogue planets traverse the cosmos, they become witnesses to cosmic violence on an unimaginable scale. 
Chance encounters with other celestial bodies can unleash catastrophic collisions, leading to cataclysmic events that reshape their very landscapes. The scars of these violent encounters, etched upon their surfaces, bear witness to the terrifying forces that govern the cosmos. In the vast expanse of the universe, where the line between science and science fiction blurs, lies a haunting phenomenon known as zombie planets. These eerie celestial bodies defy our conventional understanding of life and death, existing in a macabre state of undead existence, these macabre entities were among the earliest and most unnerving discoveries, hauntingly orbiting an undead star known as a pulsar. Among them, the ghastly trio of poltergeist Phobator and Draugr bear witness to a nightmarish existence, perpetually bathed in the relentless onslaught of radiation emanating from the pulsar's core. Poltergeist, the eerie harbinger of the group, orbits its pulsar master in a ghostly dance of death. It drifts through the void, its surface eternally bathed in an ethereal glow, as if haunted by the remnants of a cataclysmic fate. The very essence of life has been extinguished in this desolate world, leaving only spectral remnants to roam its lifeless landscapes. Not far from Poltergeist, Phobator drifts in silent torment. This sinister world, named after the Greek god of nightmares, is a chilling embodiment of cosmic horror. It exists in a perpetual state of dread, its atmosphere thick with foreboding and its desolate surface haunted by the echoes of forgotten terrors. Phobator serves as a harrowing reminder that even in the vastness of space, nightmares find a way to materialize. Draugr, the third member of this ghastly trio, completes the spectral ensemble. Its name borrowed from Norse mythology, Draugr evokes images of vengeful spirits rising from the grave. This planet's existence is a testament to the enduring grip of death, as it circles its pulsar master in a macabre waltz. Its lifeless expanse is a somber tableau, forever trapped in a state of spectral decay. These pulsar planets, in the haunting embrace of their undead star, endure a ceaseless assault of radiation. The pulsar's core, a dormant remnant of a massive star's cataclysmic demise, emits a relentless torrent of energy that engulfs these ill-fated worlds. The constant bombardment of lethal radiation transforms their surfaces into charred wastelands, devoid of life or hope. As we traverse the cosmic landscape, we encounter the harrowing sight of planets orbiting ancient remnants, like ghosts trapped in an ethereal prison. Moons encircle the shattered husks of annihilated stars, and even planets that orbit around a supermassive black hole. They serve as a haunting reminder that the cosmos is not solely a place of wonder and awe, but also a realm of cosmic predators and captive worlds. And as we venture further into the unknown, May we never forget the horrors that lurk in the shadows, awaiting our curious souls.